Brett, when you look back on the successful career that you've had to date, and I know you still got a ways to go, but if you look back so far, what's the biggest career growth driver to you? What do you say? Wow, that had really had a big impact on the growth of my career. I would say that the, the biggest growth driver for me was when I made the decision working at an architecture firm. I had been there for just over five years practicing architecture, you know, only five years out of school. Um, the, the decision I made to switch over to the technology side of the business. Um, as I look back to that, it was obviously a, a big decision for me, only five years out of school um, to make, you know, what really was a career change at the time. Um, but it sent me down a path of, of so much more learning and opportunity and experience um, that I think it really set me up for, you know, the rest of my time with that firm and set me up to come to Delta at some point. So that by far was, was probably the biggest growth driver for me. That's great. And I, the reason I really like that, Brett, is because I think a lot of professionals today, you know, students, they go to college, they major in something, you know, they become a certain, get into a certain type of profession. And, you know, they can have a real rigid mindset on it. Like, you know, I went to school for this. I paid a lot of money. I got this degree and I kind of kind of stick with this. But, you know, I think you're proof that, you know, it might take some courage, you know, being a little, it may feel a little risky, but you kind of make that move that can really change your career. Would you, would you agree with that? Absolutely. I mean, I, I think of, um, you know, my, my evolution or my path, I, I went from architect to IT manager, IT director to software product manager. Um, you know, that's, that's a, that's a quite a, a departure from, you know, going to school for architecture. So I, I'm, I'm proud of that. I'm happy, no regrets, but you're right. It is representative of the fact that, you know, coming out of school, school teaches you to, to, um, you know, be perhaps in a specific area or a specific career, but it also prepares you for, you know, life in general. And, you know, what path you choose does not necessarily have to be the path that was set up by that education. And I, and I think, you know, I think I'm a little bit of a representative of how that might be possible. 